Hey everyone, how's it going? It is Memory here. Ladies and gentlemen, we're here for the 11th episode of Violet Evergarden, and you all know what the deal is. This series has just been absolutely incredible as of late. These past few episodes have just been something else. I really cannot say enough uh, about what this series has been doing lately, and I'm just really excited to, to get into more. So without further ado, let's get into this 11th episode. We're going to start in 3, 2, 1, play. Just this one. Oh, really? That's interesting. They're going to send Violet. They have to. So it's probably the most dangerous task, job. Okay, so there is peace now, just a former enemy. Violet wants to do it. She wants to go. She's going to burst in here and be like, send me, I'm going. <laughs> or maybe not. Camp Menace. There's a soldier. Wants to write to his loved one. Apparently her name's Maria. Aw. Violet's gonna do it. <laughs> it would it wouldn't make sense if Violet didn't do it. <laughs> right? So that's what we're going to see in this episode. But of course the the stuff with Violet and Gilbert and that whole flashback was absolutely like I words cannot even describe. I I I've said incredible. I've said like every word you could say about it, right? But even like the the side stories lately, like the like have been just something else. Like mostly wrecking but it's like beautiful at the same time. It's like. And I forgot to mention, apparently there's a new Violet Evergarden project in the works. Now, it hasn't been confirmed whether it's an anime or another novel or whatever the case is. I just saw it on Twitter today when I woke up. And it was like, new Violet Evergarden project is underway like could it be a film could it be a second season i don't know if there's enough content for a second season or someone mentioned like the gaiden light novel for violet evergarden i don't know if they'd adapt that or what what project this is going to be just kind of all people guessing kind of speculation right now so uh if i do have more on that i'll keep you guys updated here we go and Violet took it, and she dipped. Okay, so she's not even going to say anything to them. <laughs> she gone. Well. She gone. <laughs> One week away. Oh, my gosh. Look at this, like, scenery. Oh, this is going to be beautiful. It is beautiful already. Like, We got the mountains. We got snow. Yes. Yes. Ooh. Man, that's war for you. That's. Violet knows all about it.
it's not safe. <laughs> and Violet heard them talking about it, so she's... That is exactly the reason why. That's why she wants to go. An airplane and the next one, man, Violet's asking for quite a bit here. <laughs> She's dead serious about it, though. <laughs> He's like, how can I turn her down? <laughs> oh, so they're actually going to go with it. Dude, Violet in this outfit, man. Yes. Yes. <laughs> At least they weren't like the biggest dicks about it, right? Like, they could have been like, no, what, what, you're asking for too much, get the hell out of here, like, come on now. <laughs> They're actually helping her out, so. Oh, dude, what is up with this show and all the, like, the random shots, like, with Gilbert, like, now this, like, out of nowhere, it always happens like that, oh my gosh. They don't know what the hell to do, look how they're, like, scrambling. Oh my goodness. Oof. Tango down. <laughs> Uh-oh. No, 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 no. If he shoots him while he's in his arms, like... Okay. Maybe not. Sniper has some good aim, though. He's a, he has a good shot on him. Oh, he did shoot him. Right in his arms, too, man. You have to just get out of here, man. I'll just start running. Yeah, it's unfortunate, but... Man, the certain shots that... In this episode so far, like, of course it's Kill Annie, but, like, so damn good. Like that. Like, just the little things. I love. Love with this series. And how it's animated and the music. And just look at all the bodies. <sighs> yep. Is she about to jump out? Oh. So he's still he's still alive. He's still. Ooh, 
with a bayonet. Someone's coming out! Look, yo! Look at Violet, that is so dope. The parachute and everything? Oh my goodness. Dude, that is so sweet. That is so sweet. Yo, look at her go! Oh my god! Violet! He's like, I don't I'm not messing with you. <laughs> well, they could just shoot, turn around and start shooting. I wouldn't trust them just being able to walk away like that and not... The letter, Aiden. And he's still like... Hanging on to life at that point, like. So Yale was the one who. It was that. What was that? That's what his name was, right? Was it Yale? But he was the one who told him about it, recommended the Oh, she's a beauty. Ah, dude, she's so cute. Like look at his lips, like the condition the he's in. Probably because he doesn't know how much longer he has left. Uh, exactly. Memorizing your words on my fingers. No way. But I mean, if Violet, Violet could do something like that, right? Like, ah. This man's like he's lost his parents. He's. In this war, civil war. Mario will be last, yeah. I still can't get over Violet, like, memorizing the, the words with her fingers, like, <laughs> that is incredible. Picture of Mario. Just coughing up blood, like, dude. We better hurry up and s say what he has to say for Mario. Mm-hmm. 
That sucks because like they were starting to become a thing. No kiss, no anything, and he has to leave. Like that happens with a lot of like families, a lot of couples, and especially with the war when they're and whether it's the dad or you know, even the mom nowadays, right? That has to go out, or most of the times it's the father, I'd say, or you know the male, but. She's so beautiful. Man. Lila's trying to hold back tears of, her, of, of herself right now. You can tell. She's feeling this one. I'm dude, man. Like, I don't like the whole I don't want to die. That ah. His lips. I can't get over his lips like that. <laughs> and just his face, like his expression, like look at him. He's... I love you. I think that's what he just said. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Man, but that's just like Violet would do anything for anyone, right? Like, and she's she, like I said, she's feeling this one. You could tell. Like, I mean, lost his parents, shipped away the the love of his life, pretty much, right? Like, didn't get to kiss her, didn't get to say that to her, like. He didn't have much time left, and he's, he's no more now. But Violet will deliver those letters, you, you bet. But the parents, right? If the parents are gone, I don't know about Mario. If Mario's the same way, but. To Maria? <gasps> oh my gosh. Okay, so the mom and dad are still alive. 
I thought the mom and dad had passed. Unless that's, is that the mom and dad? Is that a blood stain on it? Yeah, it is. With the. Okay, maybe that's not her, his parents. Sorry. Because there would have been a letter for them, too. And I knew it was going to be like this, too. Like, once the, the news, the letter, just everything got to her. Like, that looks like the mom and dad, though. I don't know. <laughs> Okay, that is the mom and dad. I thought I must have got confused by how it was worded or how it was shown earlier. Like, damn man, look at Violet's expression, the reaction from her. Like, Oh my gosh, dude. Look at those. Look at her. Look at her. Oh, tears, dude. Oh. My gosh. Oh my gosh. We've never saw Violet break down. Like, well, yeah, we have. But just to hear like that, like that thank you, that thank you, that thank you from, and to see the, like how much uh, these people like really really care that you know, Violet was able to get back you know something from them. Obviously, the news of him passing and was terrible, right? And just really saddening news. But they got to they got to get something from him. They got to hear something from him before he he you know passed. Dude, just hmm. God, this series lately, man. I I don't know how much more I could take. I don't know how much more Violet can take. She's like crying in every episode now, <laughs> breaking down in every episode. But it's just like, that's what it comes with understanding. Like at the beginning of the series, Violet wouldn't get like that at all. Like now that she's starting to really, really understand human emotions more and just you know how humans feel about one another in general. Like it, it's getting to her. It's hitting her. And just wow, man. Just wow. And just, uh, just Aiden, like, there lying on, the, like, his last inches of life. Like, Mom, Dad, Maria, like, and even to Maria, like, I don't want to die. I want to see you again. I want to be with you again. I want to kiss you. I want to say, like, I love you. Like, the, you know, the things I never got to say to you, I want to say to you. I just, everything, man. Like, ah, uh, Jesus. It's just been a, I mean, this series is a field trip as a whole, but, like, just lately, it's just every damn episode is just, like, crushing. <laughs> uh, let me know what you guys thought of the episode of, of Violet Evergarden, episode 11, everyone. Uh, if you did enjoy the video, make sure you drop a like, subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Thank you for watching. Peace.